Careful, kids. All right, watch it. I'm gonna send the ladder down. All right, heads up. Got it. Get it? There. Thanks. Here, give me your guns. Can't take them out on the street. Ah, uh, right. Much as I'd like to. Okay, I think we're clear. Come on. We gotta make ourselves scarce before any more of them show up. All right, up here. This way. Easy, kid. Stay away. Stay away. What's wrong with him? They drugged him. What? Come on, we gotta get him out of here. Come on, stop. Touch me! All right. No. no. We just, we just want to help. Get away! Get away from me. Give them to us. 
I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Good. Damn, I don't know. I don't know. Please. I don't know. Welcome back. I don't recommend making a scene. You're not exactly here legally, remember? Greatness from small beginnings. Beneath that cocky exterior, you're still the same scared, filthy little runaway, aren't you? Skip the mind games. You don't know me. In fact, I suspect I know you better than anyone, Mr. Drake. Of course, that's not your real name, is it? But we won't dwell on that. Mother commits suicide. Father surrenders son to the state at the age of five. Entrusted to the St. Francis Boys Home. <laughs> it's also Dickensian. <laughs> oh. Don't worry. She's of no interest to us. Unless, of course, we need to apply a little pressure. What do you want from me? Well, as much as it pains me to admit it, I need your help to find Victor Sullivan. Right. We already know he has the coordinates to find Iran. How do you know that? <laughs> you told us, Nathan. It seems your loyalty isn't as firm as you'd like to think it is. What about his? What? Wait. What are you trying to pull? Nothing. It's just that... Well, we've had you in our clutches for quite some time now. And he hasn't exactly mounted a rescue. He didn't rescue you back in Cartagena, either. He just saw something he could exploit. I know what you're trying to do. Trust me. Victor is only ever in it for Victor. It's a cold, hard fact. I discovered it 20 years ago. I'm surprised it's taken you this long to figure it out. You're wasting your time, lady. Fair enough. But ask yourself, when he scooped you off the streets of Columbia 20 years ago, did he save you from that life? Or did he just doom you to this one? Ah, excellent. Well, we've located Sullivan on the other side of the city. I'm sorry, Nathan. It seems you've been removed from the equation. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Pardon me. Excuse me. There he is. I think you lost me, didn't you? Come on, Talbot, this is getting old.
يا صباح الفلافل والحمص والبابا غنوج ريمبر مي رمسز يو شود ثانك مي ماي فريند رايت ثانكس نو ريلي ذا انجلش ليدي بيد مي تي جيت ريد اوف يو بوت مي ام ا نايس جاي اي سيفد يور لايف رايت ناو اي ام ذا اولي فريند يو جات Now you figure I owe you something. Is that it? Smart guy. I like that. You are a way ahead of me. It is really a simple question. Aram of the pillars. <sighs> of course. Where is it? I don't know, buddy. Bullshit. Look, even if I did know, my life wouldn't be worth very much once I told you. Now would it? You insult me. You're a pirate and a good businessman. Give me some respect. Let's try this again. Where is Aram Nathan? Look, you can torture me all you want. Okay. But I can't tell you what I don't know. Maybe so. We'll see if your friend is more cooperative. What? Who? Your friend, Victor Sullivan. I don't want to do this. At his age, it may be too much for him. Wait. No, no, no. You have given me no choice. Perhaps your friend will be more grateful for his life. Wait. Leave Sully alone. By Nathan. You don't touch him. <laughs> This is gonna be fun. Don't want to tell us what we want to know, huh? I'm talking to you, boy. Oh. Where did you come from?
Rum. A cliché. Now we're talking. Empty. Of course it's empty. Nothing. 